Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the Hunter Call of the Wild. My name is Ohio Man, and today we have our Christmas special today. Merry Christmas, everyone. Uh, so I've decided to uh, give a tour of my lodges. Now I have three lodges here. I have my... Oh, trophy lodges. I have my main first lodge. This is my North American lodge, so... Uh, any North American animals or anything? This is my exotics lodge, any exotic animals, and then this is my diamond lodge, which we'll get to last. So, uh, start it off here, we'll go with our North American lodge here, which is, funny enough, in Africa. So we're gonna start off with the entrance here, we got the albino, uh, female, uh, whitetail, and the melanistic male, which, funny enough, got in the same exact spot in Leighton Lakes, uh, back to back days. So I got this one first, and then I got this one uh, the next day. Uh, go over here before I forget. Just a light brown turkey over here, and these are some some of the first animals ever to be put in the lodge. Uh, this is back when I went goose hunting a lot uh, in the beginning to get money, and uh, no diamond geese. I never got a diamond goose. I should probably go back and try and get one. But yeah, I got that brown hybrid there, and then all those other ones, so that's cool. Um, Up here, so I have a lot of animals left over, and I'll probably just scroll through them here. Just a bunch of animals that I don't really know what to do with. Bunch of whitetail, and you'll see why I have so many whitetail um, after a little bit. But, uh, just, uh... 235 uh, mule deer. No nothing special up here. I got a few gold uh, Rocky Mountain elk up here. That's the biggest one. This is so. This is my turkey room. Uh, I've killed so many turkey in this game. I decided to dedicate an entire room to it. Now this isn't the animal that I've killed the most, and I will. You'll find out what that is uh, real quick. Um, but all these. Uh, now, now you will not see any diamonds in the first two lodges because I put all of the diamonds in the last lodge. So just a bunch of turkeys in here, like nothing special. Just a bunch of light browns here that I got. And I will say my favorites are the eastern wild turkeys, just because that's what I have where I live. So I like those, and I actually have a diamond in that, but you'll see that later. That's actually, I believe, the first video on my YouTube. So, now this this deer has some history. You'll see that it's a 270. Now with the new scoring, this would actually score gold. But the deal, what the deal with this is, is this deer was shot before they changed the the white tail scoring. So back when 275 was diamond scoring. So this is a 270, and I messed the shot up, and actually I'll put the dot right where I shot it. I shot it right below the heart, right here. I was 80 yards away from it, and I shot it right below it. I was so mad, uh, and it, it dropped right away, too. I was like, yes, I got a hard shot, and then that happened. Just a quick uh, multi-mount here with uh, white-tailed jackrabbits. Now, uh, you'll quickly see the amount of white tail that I have in here. Every single one of these is a gold, okay? All the gold whitetails, and this was pretty much my grind. Well, most of them are gold. They're all high-scoring whitetail. Um, but these were all in the grind to get a diamond whitetail, and funny enough, I only have one diamond whitetail. Um, most of these, if not all of them, no, most of them, most of them are all on Leighton Lakes, from Leighton Lakes. I'd say about maybe five of them are from uh, Rancho, and then maybe one or two are from the new map, Mississippi. Which I gotta say, I'm really loving that Mississippi map. All these, I have an albino Rocky Mountain elk here, and then a gray mountain lion, which if you've been watching my videos, you'll know that I just got a new diamond gray mountain lion, which you'll see in the uh, next lodge. Pretty much the second most killed animal that I have is probably pronghorn. I just didn't uh, mount as many as I did the whitetail. Quick multi-mount here. Just got a puma and a 
or mountain lion and uh, black tail there for you. Quick sneak peek in here. My favorite multi mount is this. This is my absolute favorite multi mount. I love this. This is hilarious. And this, I literally just put here. I don't know why I put that ram there. I just put it there. Uh, I got the two gators though, the two th or 430 and the 395, and then I got a 433.1 here. Uh, with the first and only raccoon that I've ever killed in this game. So that's cool. Killed that with a 22 uh, Hornet. Uh, moving over here, I think I forgot to cover the two Harlequin ducks that I got. These two albinos that I literally got back to back, same day, same lake. Or actually, different lake, but same day. That one's a gold 6.9, that one's a 5.9, I believe I just put this down over here. A piebald that I got the other day, 6.9. So that's cool. This is my latent lakes. Uh... Trophy lot or room, and you'll see that one isn't. No, neither is that one. That's a piebald white tail that I got on uh, uh, Mississippi. I believe that's on one of my streams. Maybe it's not a stream. That's not on a video. So almost all of these. Okay, maybe not those. That's a piebald. That's a piebald. That's a piebald. That's a piebald. That's my biggest piebald. Nineteen point four. Uh, and then that's a piebald though as well. That's also a piebald. That's not a piebald. This is a piebald though. Yeah, I got a lot of piebald uh, stuff in this room. That's a piebald up there. That that uh, black tail. A lot of moose here. Yep. I'm pretty sure these black tails are pretty much twins. And I never really liked the black tail in this game. They were always too small for me. I just, I never really liked them. This is, this is where the white tail lodge started. The first multi-mount was this one right here. This is my first ever large uh, white tail. Now these would be diamond right now. Every, almost, every single, almost every single, no, not almost every single one, but... I'd say a solid 10 whitetail in here right now would score diamond in this room. If, if they had the new scoring right now. Which is upsetting because I did, I mean, if you see the amount of work and the amount of deer that I've shot. I mean, let's see with this one. Oh, actually, the gun that I use the most... Would have been the Eckers if I have one around here. There it is. Shots fired. Oh, actually, wait. 469 kills. Oh, yeah, no. Not even close. I actually have more kills with the 300 than I do with the 6.5. The 6.5 the right here is the one I use the most right now. That's the gun I'm currently using. Um... But yeah, a lot of whitetail, and all these ducks that I got, a lot of ducks. Pretty much if it was a gold duck, I taxidermized it. Um, in here is not much, I think I just put throwaways in here. Yeah, black bear. That's a pretty big, oh, that's a piebald Rocky Mountain elk that I screwed up a shot on. That's my biggest elk too, I believe. It's unfortunate, but I mean it happens. I don't, I don't screw up many shots, but when I do, it kind of, kind of sucks. But I guess that's how it is for everything. I got the puma and the elk here. I don't know why I did that. And the elk. Got the cool gray wolf multi mount here. I know someone, uh, that would probably like this a lot. Uh. Just another, oh, okay, so that's my biggest elk. I don't know why it's here, though. And then just a random 92 scoring. Pronghorn. That, a leucistic plains bison, and a piebald moose. Pretty sure that'll do it for this lodge. Just gonna 
quickly run around, I believe. Yeah, that should be it. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna switch to Spring Creek Manor here, and hopefully the game does not crash because I think switching trophy lodges likes to give the game a heart attack. Um, but if it does, I'll just go right back into it. Not a huge problem as long as it doesn't crash while I'm hunting. So it's really all I care about. Cause honestly, trophy lodges have been the most bug thing in this entire game, which isn't bad. Well, I mean, it's bad, but, like, it's not in the middle of the map about to shoot a diamond, like, you know. But I've had things happen to me like that before. So this will be my exotics lodge, or just random stuff here. I'm a fan of this multi-mount. I really like these by seed ibex, and I think this is just really funny. This just looks funny. Uh, I'm going to go over here before I forget about them, because I know I will. Uh, we're going to go around this way on the lodge. I uh, got the two feral goats here. Uh, I think they look cool. I mean, kind of. Not really. Uh, Aqua Fishing got a goat that trolled him, and it looked massive, and it was hilarious. Random throwaway roe deer. This is the only lion that I have. And, uh, yeah, that's the only lion I have. Honestly, I think that's the only lion I've ever shot. I d okay, so I do not like the African map. I'm just not a fan of ma uh, African hunting. And actually, I don't remember if the water buffalo... I think the water buffalo... Okay, so the Cape buffalo are on Africa. Water buffalo are on Parquet. I think that's how it works. Well, the bees and the Cape buffalo, yeah. Uh, these are cool. I like these Eurasian lynx. I think they're really cool. Uh, that one's gold, and that one's just, uh, whatever, but I texturize it because it's cool. That's my only Mexican bobcat right there. That's cool. Got a puma over here. That's looking cool. These axis deer, I really want a diamond axis deer. These are really cool, and I really like the way... Th this is close to diamond, I think. I think diamond is, like, like... 198 or 199 or something but they're super cool that one's an interesting one that's why I put it up here got the Iberian mouflon and the wolves here that looks cool so now we get to the cool stuff with the biggest so this was actually a 9 legendary and it trolled me hardcore because I almost like cracked my pants uh, trying to kill this thing and I got a shot and it it was good shot I just it was a troll, and it kind of pissed me off a little bit. But that's fine. I uh, just got the teal. I like the teal. I like the way they look in the lodge. That's why I'm trying to kill more teal. Unfortunately, I don't have the parking map. I might get it. I'm not sure. Uh, I kind of want to save money for other things. But, um, yeah, I like the teal because they, they uh, look cool, and they fit in the small plaques. Now, this, I think, is the coolest part of the lodge. These red deer just look so cool up on that wall and I think it's the coolest thing I'm just gonna do a quick run through the scores 228 uh, 219 uh, 199 198 uh, 191 189 186 203 I don't know why that one's there but it is and I got Another red deer. I'll just slap it right here, honestly. Uh, where'd it go? I know it's here somewhere. Red deer. Uh, it's here somewhere. Maybe it's not. Thought it a 170 something red deer. Yeah. I'll just put that there. Just, you know what? Actually, I'll just. You know what I'll do? I will... No, that's not the one I want. I'll just do that real quick. Just because... Just for shits and giggles. Why not? Uh, let's go this way. I want to finish it off with my favorite room. Uh, I believe, yeah, I just have some Sika Deer here. Nothing really special. I had the diamond here, but then I created the diamond lodge, so. 
I had the diamond on that black right here, so there'd be those, and then there'd be a diamond right here. Thought it looked cool, but I made the diamond lodge. This is just a throwaway right here. Uh, water buffalo. The only male roe deer I've ever shot, believe it or not. I just, I don't hunt these things ever. Now we're getting to the cool part of the lodge. I really like the uh, Quattro Kalinas map, and I think it's really cool, so I like the multi mounts that come out of it. I uh, just got a random Iberian wolf there. Uh, Mouflon, Greedos, Ibex. I love these funny scores. The funny scores are hilarious. Uh, Pesites. And you'll see how much I like the Pesite Ibex once I show you the Diamond Lodge, because uh, I got some pretty cool layouts for those. I got a few. Uh, 98 funny score. And we got Iberian Mouflon here. I want to see if I can put anything here. Uh, do I have anything in exotic? Mule deer. I mean, I could put the mule deer in the exotic, just because, whatever. Uh, now this. This guy right here is the only, and I, I'm telling you, the only diamond that I've messed a shot up on, okay? I think he was running, and I shot him right here. And I, I missed vitals. And I was so mad. Because I almost had three by seat Ibex diamond, I di by seat Ibex diamonds in a row, three days in a row, almost. This is the third one, and this is actually the biggest one. Or wait, no. I think this is the second one that I found. I think I got a diamond on my map, and then what had happened was I got this one on somebody else's map, and I screwed up a shot, and I was really mad. And then the next day. I went in the same exact spot. I got all of them in the same spot. That one big lake in the north, north part of the map, where that big cliff is, um, by that lake. I got this and I was mad. So the next day, I I went on another multiplayer session and got another, uh, ibex. The next day, diamond. But out of the three, out of all the diamonds that I have, this is the only diamond that I messed up a shot on, and I'm so mad. Because I have a good reputation of, you know, getting good shots on animals. And then just a few random animals here. Nothing special. The teal, just to be placements. And yeah, that'll do it for this map. So, or this lodge. So now, oh, and then the two guns box that are crappy. So now what's going to happen is I'm going to go switch to the diamond lodge. Now this... This is a really cool lodge, and I think it's really cool, and it's 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 gonna be really cool. So here you go. Here's the diamond lodge. Here's what it looks like uh, with nothing. I mean, right off the bat, I think the entrance looks cool with the two by seed ibex. I mean, I didn't. I don't have the lodge filled or anything. I only have what 21 diamonds. So, I mean, right off the bat, I think the lot that it just looks cool. With the entrance. So we're gonna start off with the two by seed ibex, the 198. And the 198.8. I believe I got this one on my map. And then this is the third uh, one that I got. Uh, I love this animal. Let me tell you. This guy just looks super tough. Okay. This uh, Ronda Ibex. 109.9. .9. I got this on another multiplayer session. Now most of my diamonds I actually got by myself. But all the Quattro animals... And I think that secret year over there, I got on other people's animals, or other people's maps. But for the most part, most of my diamonds, especially the Silver Ridge Peaks one, except for my bison, are, like, all my map. So a lot of respawns, especially Silver Ridge. Silver Ridge has been pumping out diamonds like crazy on my map. But got a 109.9, found this. This is a level 5, and I was freaking out, and I finally made a good shot with the 6.5, and I was so happy. Uh, this Seek a Deer I got on Dale Wolfhart's map. Uh, I found it the next day. I, I saw it once, and I didn't, I didn't have a good shot on it, so I went on the next day and actually got it. Uh, 202.3 Seeka. Super cool. I mean, it's not it's not a big animal, but it just looks so cool. And I really like this one. Uh, moving back up here. As you can see, uh, I got those turkeys up there, but we'll get to those in a second. So this... Out of the three mule deer that one day, and I believe I have this one on my channel, I got this. This passed me by, 
and it went right towards Dill Wolfhart. And I was freaking out. Because I know he shoots everything he sees and doesn't care what they score. So I went and kicked both Aqua and Dale off of my map because I didn't want them to screw it up. Because that's what happens. And you'll, and you'll realize what had happened. Thank God I did that because once I tell you what happened afterwards, then you're going to understand why. This thing ran past me and um, I freaked out so I went and kicked them and then I made a good shot on it. It's all on my video. Uh, there's no commentary on it or anything. That was just a screen recording. Uh, I'm, uh, by the way, I'm still trying to figure out this whole YouTube thing and how to record and stuff, so bear with me here. But this is a 341.7. And so what had happened was there was actually three diamond mule deer, level fives, all the same rack, funny enough. And they were all on my map in the, uh, at once, all in one time. First, Aqua found one. I wasn't there for that, actually. I was not there for that one. But he shot it, and he screwed up the shot. He didn't get lethal organ shot. So then I'm hunting with Dale. Uh, me and Dale are hunting over by Wild Turkey Outpost. And I look across the lake, and there's a level 5. Right after I had shot this one, and Aqua messed up the shot on his. So I said, hey, Dale, I mean, hey, I just got this diamond. And, you know, I, I already got a diamond now. I totally could have shot that 215-yard shot. Perfect. I would have nailed the thing. All right, I could have had two. I could have had two diamond muleys on this map. I probably would have had one there and one there, and I would have put these by seat somewhere else. All right. So what had happened was I let him shoot it, and he actually had to shoot it twice, and he still screwed up the shot. It was like a 180-yard shot that he somehow managed to screw up, and I was, I'll admit, I was a little pissed off. But at the same time, I mean, that pretty much explains the reason I kicked them. So. You know, like, people are going to be like, oh, he kicked him because he's, you know, whatever. But there's a good reason, and I, I am glad I did it. So this diamond here has some history. This is the first ever diamond on on that I've ever gotten in this game. This is a, a level or 20 scoring diamond uh, mallard duck. And this, I was so excited when I got this. I screenshotted the crap out of it. I was like... Oh man, this is so cool. I put it on my gaming Instagram. Uh I was just I was so thrilled. So that's and I got that with a twenty two. Uh this one this one's funny. I was hunting with Aqua on a random person's multiplayer on Africa. And I just saw I saw a scrub hair at two hundred yards and smoked it with the twenty two. You know, I didn't think anything of it because honestly, these rabbits, I don't know what the scoring is. So if I see one, I'll just shoot one. 200 yard shot, smoked it, went and claimed it. I said, hey, Aqua, you know that uh, rabbit that I uh, shot from like 200 yards? He's like, yeah, yeah, it's a diamond. And I went and taxidermized it, and now it's in my lodge here. So that's a, that's a funny one. Um, Got uh, three east. Uh, this this one's a cool one. This is the first video that I have on my YouTube channel, cause, just because that's when I kind of figured out how to uh, rip uh, post things and I finally like figured out how to do it. That's the only reason this is the first video. It's just because it was the first one I or the the last the most recent I had taken. Uh, but a diamond eastern wild turkey. It was in the middle of the night and it was super cool. Honestly, I, I really like this one. And like I said, the eastern wild turkeys are my favorite because that's what I have around here in Ohio. So yeah, and then I got three more. Uh, Merriam turkeys, and I don't know what the deal with the three different types of turkeys is. I mean, they all look the same, but I don't know. I mean, they don't look the same, but I don't know why there's three different species, like Rio Grande and Merriam. Like, I don't know what the hell a Merriam is. But anyhow, one of these is a level two, and it actually surprised me, and it's actually on my channel. You can go check that out. That one also doesn't have commentary because I wasn't streaming, but I did screen record it. Shot it with a 22 Hornet in the neck and turned out to be diamond. I had, I was like surprised. <sighs> this one is special. This I got on Rancho and I'm mad. And here's why I'm mad is because I got it after they changed the scoring. So this is actually 256. This diamond scores less than most of my white tailed deer, which is upsetting. But the amount of time that it took me to get a whitetail that scored diamond is literally absurd. It shouldn't have taken that long. But I got it on Rancho. I don't think I have a video of that one. I actually don't even think I have a screenshot of it. Um, but yeah. 
Uh, diamond mountain goat here. Oh, it actually tells you the time that you got it. The date that you got the animal. Okay. Well, I mean, hey, if you go back and look at all the, the scores, like, the first diamond that I got here was... 2020. There you go. Yeah. So, yeah, if you go ahead and look at all the dates, uh, just go back if you wanted to look at all those real quick. Got this in this year. So... This is the gray, and I hate this multi-mount right here, that location, but it's just because it's a convenient spot to put it. Actually, can I put it there? I don't think I can. I probably can't. But this is that uh, mountain line that I got the other day. That should be on my YouTube, and this is the gray uh, mountain line diamond that I got. And actually, <laughs> funny enough, when it went behind the tree, I was freaking out because it the, it didn't look like the health was going down. So I was like freaking out trying to get a follow up, but it disappeared. And I was like, oh my gosh. So I was like, why is it not dead? Why is there no hunting pressure? And then that turned into a little mini heart attack. But then I looked back and there was hunting pressure. So I was a little bit calmer because, you know, it seemed to die quicker because I didn't know anything. Uh, there's the goat there. Here's my diamond pronghorn. Now, this is one of my favorites. I don't know if I... I think I did put it on my channel, but this one is an old video. I got this last year in December. Actually, yeah, just about a year ago. Um, and, yeah, this is just a really cool... I love pronghorn in this game. I actually... I want to hunt pronghorn in real life. I just think they're super cool. I love the uh, the antlers there. and the. I, I just think they're really cool-looking animals. Uh, this is a diamond black bear that I actually, funny enough, got on, also got on Dale's map. Um, 22.8. I've been trying to get a uh, diamond bear for a while. I mean, I've been, honestly, I mean, I'm trying to get a diamond and everything for a while. But Silver Ridge Peaks is just that map that it's like, I've got so many diamonds on now. It's like, uh, bear was just one of those animals that I didn't have one on. Uh, but yeah, that's cool. Moving in here, this one I got an aqua fishing's map. Um, oh, by the way, all the turkeys are all on my map. That's why I said I get a lot of diamonds on Silver Ridge, uh, Silver Ridge Peaks. Same thing with this mountain goat. That was my map. This is my map. And so is that mountain lion over there. Uh, oh, and both of these rims, but we'll get to those in a second. This one I found on aqua fishing's map, level 5. Kind of was like, oh, wow, this is cool. And shot it, and it was diamond. Um, but yeah, moving on to the twinsies here, I uh, got, uh, two bighorn sheep, this is the, er, which one did I get first? I think I got, well, I can look at the dates, that's right, okay, so I got this one first, this is like the first, I don't, was it the first diamond that I got on Silver Ridge? No, the pronghorn was the first, wait, I can look at the dates, that's right, 2020, 12, okay, so I got the pronghorn before that. Okay, so the pronghorn or the turkey. Oh, no, the turkey was the first one. Then I got the pronghorn. Then I got this. And this is really cool because this was my third. Yeah, that's right. This Because I, I had three diamonds in my lodge on my other lodge back when I had Seska Safari. Uh, and, uh, yeah, this is the third one that I got on Silver Ridge Peaks. And, yeah. So that one and then this one. This one I got from a tree stand or one of those building tree stands that you can build in the game. Uh, not from a DLC one. I have the DLCs, though, for Tristan's. And this one I got on my map. I don't remember where it was, though, actually. Funny enough, I usually remember where I got all my animals. I do not remember where I shot this one, but I know it was on my map. Uh, oh, it was on that one lake. Uh, what's it? Uh, over by... Did I shoot this on my map? I'm actually not sure. I know I got it recently, because it's... I got it a few months ago. I know... Yeah, it was on my map, but it was somewhere else. Uh, and I believe that's all my diamonds. Just do a quick run through the bison. So, yeah. Uh, and then all these diamonds I all got on my map. And I just... I love these Ibex. I think they look so cool in the front of the lodge. Really cool looking. And then that in the middle. 
But yeah, that's going to do it for uh, this one. Uh, I hope everyone had a great Christmas. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this little Christmas special tour lodge that I got going on here. And uh, yeah, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, and uh, hope you enjoyed it.